Hey everyone, this is Brian with TheUnlocker.com and today we're here with the Motorola Droid Razor to show you how to install the safe strap recovery software. Alright, usually when we start talking about recovery software, it's uh, one option for recovery software. Here with the Droid Razor, we actually have two. We have uh, Bootstrap, which a lot of people use, and then we have Safe Strap, which is what we're going to be demonstrating today. The main difference between Safe Strap and Bootstrap is that Safe Strap will not touch your primary system files. Uh, on your system partition, Safe Strap is essentially going to create a separate partition and that's where all your ROM system files are going to go, leaving your primary file undisturbed. So if you're a little bit uh, reluctant to try some of this, uh, Safe Strap is definitely going to be your better choice. It's definitely the safer of the two options. If you want full control and you want to be able to delete all of your system files, uh, do a complete wipe of your phone and install a completely fresh custom ROM without any of the stock Motorola files on your system partition, then Bootstrap's going to be the way you're going to want to go. Alright, before you begin, obviously you're going to need to have a rooted Motorola Droid Razor. If you haven't done that yet, uh, we do have a link on our site where we've got a video tutorial showing you how to root your Motorola Droid, which is a fairly simple procedure. Once you're rooted, uh, go ahead and there's going to be a link down below this video on the unlocker.com so you can download the Safe Strap APK. Uh, once you get that downloaded, you're going to want to make sure you go into Menu, Settings, then go down to applications and make sure that unknown sources is checkmarked. If it's not checkmarked, then you won't be able to install the uh, APK file. Alright, once we've done that, we're going to go ahead and download the uh, Safe Strap APK. And uh, I've downloaded mine straight to the phone, so uh, if you've downloaded it to a computer, obviously you're going to want to move it over to your device now. Uh, and then just simply go ahead and click uh, on it to install using any uh, file manager. I'm using Astro. And then just say uh, install when you get prompted. And then install again. And it installs like any uh, non-market application would. Once that's done, go ahead and open it. Now it's going to ask for super user uh, permissions. Go ahead and click the remember button and then click allow agree to this uh, disclaimer which basically says they're not liable for anything if you mess your phone up and then uh, we'll pick it up here alright so there's a couple of things that are going to happen at this screen um, this is simply the the way that you're going to be able to install the clockwork based recovery on your device and to do that you simply click install recovery and this is going to do a couple things it's going to set up your phone so that you can have that second system partition and it's also going to uh, um, set up a uh, hijack program on your phone basically so that when you boot you're going to be prompted to press your menu key uh, to boot directly into uh, the clockwork recovery so if you mess something up on your phone you will be able to boot into this from you know the boot screen you don't have to actually launch the phone like you do with a lot of bootstrap applications alright if you wish to uninstall safe strap uh, you've got to do this in two parts the first part is you open up safe strap application itself and then you'll see your current recovery state and you can see that our recovery state is installed meaning we have the safe strap recovery loaded and installed on our phone so the very first thing we're going to do is we're going to uninstall recovery and then that's going to go ahead and cycle through and now you can see our recovery state says that it's not installed the second step to this process is we're actually going to uninstall the safe strap application and you can do this quite simply by going uh, to menu settings going to applications manage applications and then we can come down to safe strap and then from here we can uninstall the actual program and then once you've done that you've removed the recovery and you removed the actual application and it's completely off your phone and aside from the downloaded you know safe strap you know APK file there's no traces uh, of safe strap on your device alright and that concludes this tutorial for how to install the safe strap application and recovery software uh, from here you can go to the unlocker.com and check out our links we'll have a link up 
for how to install a ROM using safe straps so go ahead and check that out next and you, you're one step closer to getting your custom ROM on your Motorola Droid Razor. This is Brian with TheUnlocker.com. We'll see you next time. Thanks a lot. Thank you.